Hello there. So today it's our very last Tales of the Jedi. It's episode six. It's called The Resolve. Um, I am stoked to see it, but also sad because it's the end of this fantastic mini series. I've actually loved this um, so much. So without further ado, let's watch this last episode. Come on, let's do it. Padme's funeral. Mum Mothma. He spotted her. She, she's unmistakable. There she is. You shouldn't have come here. What? She's sad. She was my friend. Yeah, they did a lot together, didn't they? A lot of missions and stuff. There's a patrol coming. We must leave. I think that's sweet that she attended the funeral, knowing that she was being hunted by these lot. Order 66 is still alive, I assume. If you need anything, you can contact me with this. Ah, she's gone, of course. If you should ever need anything. <laughs> he said that just for her. I bet they're as confused as anything. Look, what was he on with? Yeah. That that was again a very clever touch. An early ATST version of um the Sorry, I cut myself off there because I just saw Ahsoka walk in the way. Uh oh. Ooh. <laughs> and funnily, every bile missed her. I just love this girl. I will say that many times. I just think she's phenomenal. Very lucky child. Yeah, very lucky that ah Ahsoka was there. I think she called her Ashley. Because George Lucas named this character Ashley before it was changed to Ahsoka. So if that if he, if she said Ashley, then that's a nice little a nice little touch to um, a nod to George Lucas. Oh no, is that their um, their little village? This doesn't look good. He dobbed her in, scumbag. You lied to me. He's not lying. Here she is, unarmed. This is a little bit worrying. Good girl. Well done, Ahsoka. Yeah, I tell you what, mate. I think he's in the shit. Forgive the language. Fighting stance. She's ready. Oh my God, I'm at it again. Didn't stand a chance to, oh my god, what a, I'm a, such a melt, really tearing up. <laughs> of course, she had the little device to communicate, didn't she? Things have only gotten worse. Are you sure you're ready to get back into the fight? Oh my god, I am such a grown up nerd. Let oh, me just press stop. Okay, so um, we've just finished watching episode 6 of Tales of the Jedi, and it was great. I think we definitely saved the best till last. Uh, I have no idea why I keep tearing up. I think it just shows how fans of all Star Wars content, no matter what it is, get attached to certain characters. And as I said, I love Ahsoka. She's got so much about her. She's been trained by Anakin. She's got his kind of like, I suppose, naughtiness, 
not playing by the rules necessarily, but she's also spent time with Yoda and Obi-Wan, so she's got a lot of all of those kind of going on with her. But she's just a brilliant Jedi, and she just steps in when she needs to. She's very subtle, and when the Inquisitor came strolling along and looked at her and said her name, oh, I just couldn't hold it back. It just hit me really, really hard because she is such a great Jedi and she's renowned. And I don't think she realises how good she is. Um, but the whole series has been phenomenal. Dave Filoni, an absolute genius. Um, all your crew putting such a great um, series together. I really hope there's a series too. Um, following... Ahsoka again, I'm more than happy to do that. But if you want to pick some different Jedi's to um, show us that we're not familiar with, etc., because a lot I know a lot of these things are in comics and things, but many of those Jedi's we're not familiar with. So if they've got a bearing on Jedi's that we are familiar with, then yeah, that's that's have a bit of um, information on those, a few series on them. But score wise. I've been giving eight and a half to nine and three quarters, I think, was episode five. This is a certain brilliant 10 out of 10. I'd give it more if it were possible. Uh, I saw it a thousand out of 10. It was brilliant. The Inquisitor, I thought, I don't know who he was, but I loved his design. He was scary. He was brutal. About to chop that young lad's head off for helping them out. It just goes to show you can't trust the buggers. Um, but Ahsoka made easy pickings of him. She just grabbed the sabre, switched it off, turned it around, switched it back on again, kicked him, and his head hit the floor. And it deflated. Very strange. But the whole series has been fantastic. Like I said, episode six was my favourite because it was all kind of about Ahsoka and what she's doing and what she's up to. And at the very end, what happened? She nods as if to sort of say, yes, I'm coming back. Which I kind of knew, um, watching Rebels and all the rest of it that go along with it, full crumb and all that. Um, but anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the series as much as me. And um, as always, please like and subscribe. Subscribe helps me out no end. It just goes to show, it shows me, I should say, that um, people enjoy my content. And I might have said this before, that it means that I will continue to make content if people are enjoying it. Um, so for me, that's it. Again, thanks for your time. If, um, by the way, you want to see any of my other reactions, check up here. Um, not there, just there. Um, there's more tales of the Jedi reactions there and play more and or content. And there's all kind of stuff. So check out my um, whole channel and hopefully you'll see a lot of things you enjoy. Anyway, I have spoken way too long, so I will leave you to it. Again, thanks for being here. Take care. And hopefully we'll see you all very, very soon. Bye for now.